Hey, what's going on everybody? Full Furniture today bringing y'all a Clash Mini video and in today's video we are about to hit 1200 and rank up to Legendary yet again. This is the deck that I'm using right now. I've had inconsistent win streaks with it, but also I played a few games against Truefet, who is one of the other top players. He might actually be, yeah, he's num currently ranked number 16. And he was playing this Barbarian King deck. And I gotta say, Dart Goblin completely shreds. So if you're looking for a good Barbarian King deck, this is a really good one to use. And then this is the World Champion deck that I've been running. Mini P.E.K.K.A. with the Dissipate is really good versus other World Champions. Uh, if you're able to get pulls with the Fisherman onto the World Champion. Or if they have like a Barbarian King or like a Mega Knight in their front line. The Dissipate works really well for that. And then I have been playing around with this Wave Master deck. The Magic Archer is really good versus Archer Queen World Champions. Because it has that piercing with the arrow. And you can add that plus one at the first star. And then the rest of it is really just defense and keep that magic archer alive. Wave Master does really good for backline as well. So if you're interested in a Wave Master deck, then you can try that one out. But we are currently one win away. Let's see. Oh, we're going up against Mick. He's a really good uh world champion player as well. So let's see what we can make happen here. Um we're gonna go with the mini Pekka. Oh, I'm gonna sell this. I will I like to start with Valkyrie Giant Skeleton. That it, it just feels like a good like all-around start. Alright, so he didn't use the launch uh the shell pad either. We do get the bounce, which is big. And with that, we are gonna pull ahead, so we will be able to take this first round. Getting that first, getting the shield timing just right to make sure you get your shield bounce with the level 10 world champion is so crucial. Um, so let's see what we can actually make happen here. We do already have the Valkyrie in play. So I think we're going to roll with a comp like this. Just in case he uses the shell pad, I want to make sure nothing is on that side. But... I could, what I could have also done was played our world champion. He actually launches the world champion over. Very interesting. Our giant skeleton bomb is going to help us out a ton here. We are going to get some beautiful bounces. Oh, oh, that's so satisfying to see. You just love to see things like that with the world champion. Okay. So let's, let's actually grab this. And we're just going to go with the double upgrade here. I'm going to bring this wizard over in front. We're going to launch our world champion over to his side this time. Because if he pulls a wizard, it's not the complete end of the world. He doesn't pull anything. Our world champion is going to be on his side. Our giant skeleton takes everything. Oh, the ve Oh, my. Oh, giant skeleton. Hold everything. Put in in the work on the giant skeleton there it is gg well played i gotta say I've, I've been winning inconsistently throughout the night and we just needed that one win and there it is back in legendary league we are sit currently sitting at rank 31 if that is if that is not we're currently sitting at rank 25 or 26 what's it gonna put us at 25 or 26 25 so we're sitting at 25 right there i i kind of want to get above e2 Let, let's see <laughs> i might be pushing it a little bit here but um we're, we're going for number one that's like the ultimate goal which is not honestly not that far away 1677 wow negan's grinding a ton i i will say the minus six has made it a little bit more difficult and i'm not sure if it's just the new meta that like people are struggling but i feel i feel like like there are some really good players in this game and the fact that nobody's already at like 2000 trophies is a pretty good indicator like nobody's pushed a thousand trophies in a day because everybody was kind of reset to 750 if i remember correctly and negan's only at 1677 so and the fact that he's still climbing up trophies at the time i'm recording this video it's like 5 a.m for him or 4 a.m Negan, if you're watching this, get some sleep. Take care of yourself, too. Um, but yeah, so those three decks that I showed at the beginning, one with the Wave Master is one that I'm trying out. Um, 
it's not a hundred like it's no deck is going to be a hundred percent this world champion deck i really like i do wish my wizard was higher level though because if it was uh if it had the burn effect or the negate healing going up against a barb king or a countess that would just make the decks and matchups even better of what we'd be playing with it so hoping to get some wizards in the shop or from the uh or from the free side of the pass which also by the way um a, a couple people have been asking me about the uh how to get the mini pass if you're not from one of the beta countries to like make the purchase and stuff i'm gonna have i'm gonna hopefully have a video coming out uh later this week on how to do that and the hope is that there will also be some giveaways included in that video so make sure you hit that subscribe button and turn on that notification bell um so you don't miss that because you'll see you'll you'll see you'll see um it's gonna be hopefully it'll be really nice but so let's get over this hump oh also ice wizard is very 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 good ice wizard's so good in this meta Oh, and we're just stunning with a world champion. He is Ice Wizard is going to turn to our world champion, but we, it just needs one more spear, and then we should be able to cancel this Wave Master out. Oh, look at that! That was beautiful. That was very nice. We currently have our Wave Master at level five, and I haven't bought any from the shop. It's been quests, um, and the and the tr uh, mini pass. So I have bought some minis from the store. Um, just because I have like 20k gold. So I'm buying minis that I want. I'm refreshing about three to four times. Um, just to kind of see what I can get because it's so cheap. And then I'm completing 100% completing all of my quests. Like the weekly quests, already done. Daily quests, already done. You know, so like if you're looking to like get some minis or get on top, all the witch versus Valkyrie is like the most satisfying thing when the Valkyrie is on your team, of course. Because you just completely destroy these skeletons. So, yeah. So, to rank up quickly, make sure you're completing all your quests, getting all those golden carrots, moving up that mini pass road. Get those quests done. If you have the gold, reset the shop. First one's always free. And then just buy what you're mainly looking for. Um, and I would recommend definitely at least buying up to level 2. Because it only gets five shards, but then the rest, is to get it up to two, to get it up to three, you need another six on top of that. So it's a little bit of a steep stretch, but get those quests done. Make sure you're grinding continuously. Claim all those things, because you get extra gold from the quest too. So very, very helpful. But this is the deck that we're rocking uh, with the Royal Champion. I'll show the decks again. This is the Barb King deck. Dark Goblin, insanely good. I'm going to try to find some more decks with Dark Goblin because it's so good right now. I do only have it at level 1, though. Um, so I want to see if I can get that in the shop. And then this is the Wave Master deck that I'm playing around with. Pretty good as well. Fisherman is really fun to play with so far. But this is where we're currently sitting. We're sitting at 25th globally. Actually, no, we're sitting at 18th because I won that match. So we're sitting 18th globally right now. I'm going to be pushing my... He's still awake. Negan, go to sleep, man. <laughs> That's going to do it for this video. I hope you all enjoyed. If you did, make sure you leave a like, subscribe for more content, and don't forget to turn the notification bell so you don't miss any more videos. And I'll talk to you all in the next one. Have a great night, everybody. We'll see you later. Peace out.